I want to show you how to install MetaTrader 5 desktop platform and connect it to your XNES account. So you want to be trading on your desktop. So in order to install your MetaTrader 5, head over to your browser and type MetaTrader 5. So this is MetaTrader 5 desktop download. Click on it. So once it opens, is the metatrader5.com. You go to download, click on it. Now you have different options depending on the operating system that you are using. So there is download for Windows here, and I'm using Windows, so I'll click on it. Once your download is ready, double click on that file to start installation. So once you have this option pop up, click on next. This is just the usual installation that you usually do on your system, nothing else. Allow it to install and it will be ready. Congratulations, it is done. So you click on finish. So you go to your startup menu where all your installations begin. So you have MetaTrader 5A and it installs it with the editor. You don't need the editor for trading. You only need it for algo trading, like use of robots. You customize your own robot. So it's MetaTrader 5. This is the app. I'm going to right click on my Windows. Okay, so pin to taskbar. So it's the taskbar. I am going to pin it to the taskbar. So it will be pinned somewhere here so that I can have access to it any time I want. Cancel this. Now these are the different windows of the different assets that you are trading. So you see this is for Euro USD. You can cancel this out to have only a single window. Okay. So then you can enlarge this. Even this one is not a must for you to do. So you can cancel it out. You can cancel it out. Now my essence is for everything to look very simple for you. Cancel this out. Okay. So you have your graph. Now you need candles. I am used to candles and not to this type. So is this one I'm going candlesticks. I will choose this one instead. Okay. So if this is your first time of using the MetaTrader 5 desktop platform, simply go to the videos or to my playlist. You will see everything regarding MetaTrader 5 platform there, where I'll be showing people how to use it on desktop. Okay. So I've shown how to change the colors of these candlesticks. You can go and watch it over there, how to remove these grid lines. So I will now show you how to log into your XNES account on this MetaTrader 5 desktop platform. So I'm going to switch over to my main laptop that I have already installed MetaTrader 5 on it. And the candlesticks are already red and green, which is what I have been using. Okay, so I'm going to change the system. So I'm just simply using a new system that I have not installed MetaTrader 5 on it just to show you how to do the installation. But for the login in to your XNES, connecting your MetaTrader 5 desktop platform to your XNES account, I will now switch over to my main laptop. So here we are on the MetaTrader 5 desktop platform. You can see at the top here, it's telling you it's a demo account. In order to connect your XNES, I need to show you the details. So I'm going to log into my XNES trading terminal. So this is the XNES trading terminal. You need to go to your account. So where your account is with your name and your amount, click on it. So you click on manage account. The reason why we are doing this is to get our login details into MetaTrader 5. So the server details, the login details. 
That is what we want to get. Cancel this. At the creation of this account, I chose MetaTrader 5. So it means I can only log into the MetaTrader 5 platform. This other account, I can only use MetaTrader 4 as you are seeing. So it depends on what you are choosing. Okay. Some people may go choose MetaTrader 5 and they will want to log in on MetaTrader 4. And at the end of the day, they will come and complain that they will write trading disabled for this account or unable to log in or you can't have access. Yes, because you are not choosing the right platform. When creating any account, you have to choose the platform that you are going to use for trading. So if you are used to MetaTrader 5, choose MetaTrader 5. So I've chosen MetaTrader 5. That's why I want to log into the desktop platform now. Okay. So these three dots that you are seeing here, I will click on it. Then my account information, I will click. Now I have it scroll down. And now have my server is XNES MT5 real 9. And my login is this. So I will copy, click to copy. That's your account. Now go back to your MetaTrader platform. So go to file. You see, they are showing you option to log in to trade. So click on it. Very good. So you paste it here. Okay. Now your password, I will blow this. So your server MT5 real. You search Xness, click enter, then come back again to search. We are looking for MT5 real. So this is my server Xness MT5 real nine. Then you click on OK. So automatically, I have been logged into the account. Okay, I have been logged into this. So click on View Standard. Later. So I am in my account right now. Now, if you have logged in. You will see at the top here the login account number, the server, and you will see the asset that you are trading. Now, how would you know that you have actually logged in, like the amount that you have? Go over here, this show or hide the toolbox option that you have. This button show or hide the toolbox bar. Click on it. I have clicked. You can see something pop up under here. I need to stretch it up a bit for you to see. So I have stretched it up. This part is just for the mailbox. So these are all the mails that I'm having. This part is for news. This is for the history of what happened today. And then other options, okay, exposure. You now have balance. I remember I have 321.05. This was what was in my XNES terminal. Let me show you again. Over here is corresponding to the same amount here. So it shows I have logged in already. Okay. So let me go back there. Good. So under this other option is for your trade. If you are currently in any trade, you will see it over here. Now I'm not in any trade. So it's still the same account balance. Okay. So all these ones you enter into any trade, you see the time you enter, the type, the volume. So it will help you to be journaling it. Okay. So those that don't know how to journal, simply subscribe here and I'll show you how to journal your trade.
using MT5 desktop platform. It has a lot of benefits more than the mobile app. But just that the mobile app is handy, but if you want to know about journaling, seeing your charts clearly, as you can see, and even by testing it for free, all these things can be done. Okay, so subscribe and I will show you more. Now, this is how to connect your XNES account to MetaTrader 5 desktop platform. If I want to take a trade now, I will go over here, this new order, you click on it. Okay, so I'm on GBP USD right now. That's why it's showing me if you execute this market execution, if you don't want you change all the and put if it's a pending execution, you put your lot size that you want over here, your stop loss, you can set your take profit, but that will be in another video. So do remember to subscribe if you have any question regarding this MetaTrader platform or anything regarding trading, simply let me know and I will answer you. Remember it was one of the users or one of the subscribers that requested for this and I'm making it. So if you request for any video that are having difficulty in trading Forex, I will make the video for you. Have a nice day. Bye.